You're sitting near the front wheel of a rover, a prototype of one NASA wants to send to Mars in 2020. It's traveling across a testing ground at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory near Los Angeles. Try panning the camera down and look at the six wheels rolling across the dirt. Each wheel has its own motor, so the rover can roll in all directions but also spin in place. And there aren't any actual tires because of course you can't repair a puncture if you get one on Mars. Instead, the wheels are made of aluminum. Driving across Mars is challenging because you don't want to get stuck on a big rock or in a sand dune. That's why engineers are testing it here. At top speed, the rover will never go faster, just an inch or two each second. The new rover will have a job that no space robot has ever had to collect bits of the Martian surface. So as it drives across the sand and the dirt and the rock, it will sometimes stop to gather a sample. Pan the camera up and look at the rover's body. The brackets that you see will hold a robotic arm that can reach out with a drill. Every so often it will drill into a rock, fill a tube with material, then seal it and put it back on the rover's body. Eventually the rover will stop and lay those filled tubes down on the ground. One day, NASA plans to send another spacecraft to come pick them up and bring them back to Earth. If it works, it will be the first ever sample return from Mars, and it may even answer that burning question we've always had, was there ever any life on Mars? <laughs>